Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala inside the soul in the body of child. So, then created to angels, created to earth and skies, then created to space, space is meaning between earth to skies, and then first sky to second skies, then space is available, then second sky to third sky, space is available there. And from earth to first skies, what is distance, space distance? The Holy Prophet peace be upon him says, if anyone here travels with any convenience for 500 years, then he can reach there. And thickness of first sky is 500 years travel. So, seven thousand years travel available between earth to sun stars. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created to spaces, created to messengers, Abhiya alayhi wasalatu wasalam, and revealed to holy books, then created to see the occasions, created to different fishes in sea in occasions. So many qualities are available in the sea. Why Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala has created to all items, all creations, meaning that people can understand that one personality is available, one personality, one power is available who had created to all world and to all creations because any factory, any manufacturer, any person, any evils, they can't create to any items, natural items, even they can't make one hair of body, only Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala had created to all items. So that then Allah Azawajal created to had created to sun, moon and stars, created to evils, created to airs, created to animals, created to birds. Even Allah Azawajal subhanahu wa ta'ala had created to 700,000 creations. This is a power of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So that at least what is meaning of a great setup of the whole world and uh, this is not acceptable Allah Azza will be create to any setup without any reason. This is against the personality of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah Azawajal will create to any item without reason, this is not acceptable. So that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had created to 700,000 creations and, he, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and uh, a great setup in this world. In the Holy Quran, Allah Jalla Shahu says, Inna Allah la yastahyi an yadriba mathalam ma ba'udatan fa ma fawqa. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah the Almighty, does not hesitate for any example, even equal the box or equal the wings of box or any fly. Understand? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not feel any hesitates. For example, because he is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the owner of the whole world and items of the world. 
from all centers, first of all, we are getting knowledge about strong power of Allah Azzawajal. From all setup, which knowledge we are receiving and uh, we are getting meaning first of all, we can understand Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has a too much power. No one can come at the front of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala power wise, authority wise. No one has any authority. No one has any powers equal to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because he is an owner of the whole world. So that we are getting knowledge about power of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Second, Allah Azza wa Jal has created to word and heaven for respect and authority and miracles of the Holy Prophet of the Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Why? Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala has created to hold word, meaning first of all, Allah Azza wa Jal has explained to people about the power of God. Second, why Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created the whole world? For the respect of the Holy Prophet of Muhammad. So that people can understand my beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu has a too much respect and spiritual power and miracle and highest rank in my court. Above all messengers. Third, Allah Zawajal has created to all creations and women with evil for worship. Third meaning, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created to all women, evil, angels, meaning 700,000 creations, Allah Zawajal has created only for worship. In the Holy Quran, Allah Azawajal says, Sabbaha lillahi maam is-samawati wa maam fil ard. All items, all items which are available in this world, under the earth, on the earth, in the sea, locations, in the air, in the heavens, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created them only for worship. And all creation, they are reciting to the quality names of the Rabtala Jalla Shantu. Sabbanillah Imam Ismawati Muhammad Filar. All items which are available in this world, all items reciting to the quality names of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Number four, on judgment day, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will appear to paradise and hellfire for proof of statements because my verses was true, my Quran was true. Number four, on judgment day, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will appear to paradise and help her. Because in this world, in this life, in the Holy Quran, Allah says, I have created to paradise for five and noble people. They are living in this world according to the Holy Quran, according to the declaration of the Holy Prophet, according to Sunnah. They are not going against the style of the Holy Prophet, against the verses of the Holy Quran. Those people they will enter into paradise, and those people they are living in this life, in this world, against the Holy Quran, against the Sunnah of the Holy Prophet, they will go in hell for it. 
because this is a decision of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and Allah the Almighty has announced in the Holy Quran by the Holy Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Now we will a little bit to research about for four points and important setup. Which one four points? First of all, we gain and we have received, we got a knowledge. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had a great power. Second, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had created the whole, whole world for the respect and for the appearance of the spiritual power and spiritual stage of the Holy Prophet Muhammad A which respect the Holy Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa in the court of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala at the front of the Muslim. Number three, number three, Allah Azawajal had treated to all items to humanity, to evils, to angels, to birds, mountains, trees, star, moon, sun, skies, earth. Even all items are residing in present position now, residing to the quality names of the Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And third, fourth, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created to all items for worship. No. No one can research or no one can reach at the power and knowledge of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah the Almighty, and no one can come at front of Allah Azawajal for worse, for against. No one can come at front of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for fight, for worse. Devil, devils have announced when the Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave the order to devil, to Iblis, to offer, he offer a prostrate to Adam al-Islam. He did not accept. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala rejected his all worships, all recitations. Then devil said, Oh my God, you have rejected me. Now you give me chance. I will track to your pious and noble people. I will pull to your friends, your worshippers. I will pull them at wrong paths. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Okay, I will give you chance. But you remember forever. My Pious, nobles, people, and my friend, they can't come in your net, in your net, in your trap. You can't hold them. Understand? So, No one, can be, no one can reach at the power and knowledge of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah the Almighty. No one can come at front of Allah Azawajal for words. For example, a little bit, a little bit item, hair and design of hair, design of eyes, design, design of eyeballs, hands and line of hands, line of finger and small box and wings of birds, no one can create. Who has created two hairs? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But any factory, any manufacturer, any person, they can't create one hair of body. And when you will see with the With any sources, 
when you see design of here with ten sources, I understand. You know you have it on your hairs. What design is available? All people they have different different designs on hair. No one can create one hair. No one can make a design of hair. Who has the power? Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. No one can create to any box, wings of box. No one can, can create to eyeballs. All people they have different design in eyeballs. Today, scientists they have explained and they are telling to people all people they have a different design in eyeballs. All people they have different design at fingers and thumbs. This time at airport or people in, at airport or in different departments, the officer they can track to any person by finger lines, thumb lines, finger prints. All people they have different finger prints. Who has created Allah Subhanahu? Wa These are all example of the Allah Almighty Subhanahu Wa Taala. So no one can create to all items. For example, I was explaining here. So these are all, these are items no one can create without the Allah Azza wa Jalla Subhanahu Wa Taala. Number two, the Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala was a secret bank of bounties and power. Allah Azza wa Jal wishes appearance that created to life of the Holy Prophet of the Hamza Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam from the life of Allah Azza wa Jal. Awwalu ma khalaq Allah Zuri. The first of all, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Created to life of the Holy Prophet of the Prophet. Then Allah Zawajal wish his appearance, then created to life of the Holy Prophet of the Prophet and divided in different parts. From parts of life, Allah Zawajal created to Arshay Ilahi. Kursi, Kalam, Angel, from the light of the Holy Prophet of Muhammad. First of all, Allah Azza wa Jal created to light of the Holy Prophet of Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa sallam from the personal life of the Allah Azza wa Jal. Uske zati nur se, uska zati nur da, personal life of the Allah Azza wa Jal. Separate the light, and uh, with this light, they to the Holy Prophet of the Hamas so of the And to this light, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala distributed, in, uh, divided in four parts. Then Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala from one part made to Arshayla, one part made to Kalam. Kalam of decision from one part made to kursi. Then Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala made in different parts from different parts from light. Then Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala did it to moon, sun, stars. Then divide into different parts. From this light, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala made angels and give light to brain. We have light in our brain. From that light, we have received light of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. From the light of the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Give light to eyes. 
The Holy Prophet, peace be upon him, says, the Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave life to the heart that while the noble people, they are receiving, they are reaching, they are getting closer stage of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by this light. So, <coughs> Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created to angels, paradise, sun, moon, star, light of eyes, light of brain, light of heart, even if Allah Azza wa Jal did not create to Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi that did not create to heavens and item of the whole world. So that Allah Azza wa Jal says those people will obey the order of beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi wa Sallam. Indeed they obey my order. They accept my Those people, they will accept to the order of the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Meaning they are accepting to the order of Allah the Almighty. Because the Holy Prophet, peace be upon him, did not give any instructions of life did not explain about any activities without the wahi ilahi without the order of Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala so that when you tell Rasul of those people they will obey, adapt, accept to the order of the Holy Prophet of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam indeed they accept to the order of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Number three, all creation recite or reciting quality names of Allah Azza wa Jal subhanahu wa ta'ala in the heavens, in the earth. Subhanallah, ma vissama vati wa ma filar. All creations, they are reciting to the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Because Allah Azza wa Jal had created them for worship, for recitation. And Allah khalaq al jinna wal insa illa liya hudud and I did not create to evils and women only for worship. And what is meaning of liya hudud? Liya hudud meaning when we will offer prayer, when we will recite to the quality names of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, when we will recite dhrudhi paak, upon the Holy Prophet of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam blessing and celebrations of the Holy Prophet of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam then we can get a closer stage of the arshay ilahi closer stage of the Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala meaning what, what is the meaning of liya abudun liya abudun meaning for worship but mufassirin ikram they are explaining about this world. Why we came in this, this world? Why we born for worship? And what is the meaning of worship? Then we can get a closer stage of Allah subhanahu wa We can make a pious and noble person. If anyone, he will not at the right path for worship, for recitation, for the Sunnah of the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Meaning, he is going against the religion of Islam, against the verses of the Holy Quran, against the statements of the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and declaration of the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. For example, if any student he will not study, he will not gain knowledge. If he will waste the time, can he success in examination? No. 